Don't forget the doc. Several network participants recently called into Dr. Rick Wright's Old School Sunday's radio show. Check this out. Man, but uh, let me bring up all these Syracuse University types. Got Dr. Adam Banks here, calling from somewhere in Syracuse, New York, and we also got a connection down to Washington D.C. And Lee, are you there, Lee Kent? Yes, I am, sir. Lee How are you? Keith is here from Washington D.C., and also Karen Wilkinson is, is around. So, uh, Lee, how are things going, man? All right, I'm down here at the Washington D.C. pre. Coming back together reception hosted by uh, Program and Development Office, and Larry Martin is here. Oh. And Green is in the house. Oh. The Woolies were here. Oh. oh, my goodness. We have about 50 to 70 SU alum, and they were in the house. We we're at the Thunder Grill at the Union Station. This is a fantastic moment. We're having history made in 2008, sir. Oh, I am impressed. And Karen Wilkinson is there, the, the granddaughter of Dr. Ma, Dr. Montague Carve, huh? Yes, I want to put her on the line right now, sir. Here hey, give is. me Karen Wilkinson right there with her beautiful, fine uh, self. How you doing, beautiful, fine, rich, talented granddaughter of Dr. Montague Carb, Karen Wilkinson? How you doing? I'm just fine. How are you? Oh, Karen, I miss you. So what you doing in the big-time town called Washington, D.C. at this time of your life? Well, you know, I got into teaching belly dance. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and so I teach, I've created what I call Mother Earth Belly Dance, it's all about embracing both the mothering, nurturing aspect of a woman as well as the sexual goddess. Oh. So I'm going to be bringing it up to Syracuse for CPT. Oh, Karen, you are the real deal. You know, Karen Wilkinson, everybody, did part of my uh, experiment for my Ph.D. doctoral dissertation. We created an urban contemporary format, uh, having instructional information. Six Syracuse history lesson. Remember that, Karen? Yes. You, you haven't forgotten it, have you? you well, you? I'm going to say no. Oh, I know you can't forget <laughs> it. That study became a historic study in instructional radio for my Ph.D. at Syracuse University. And Karen uh, Lee helped me put together the urban contemporary instructional radio broadcast format that we use in my doctoral oh. dissertation study years ago. Well, you know what I really remember? I remember when I was doing a weather forecast and I was kind of making it up as I went along and when I really yeah. didn't know anything else to say. When you were reviewing the tape, you said I took on a rather sexual tone when I forgot what to say. Oh. I but think that takes me into my current belly dance teaching. Your belly dance deal, huh? Yes. Karen, you well, are the real... I doc- write erotic poetry. Oh, Dr. Adam Banks. Yes, sir, Rick. What's happening? Everything is kicking. And Karen Wilkinson, a new professor who has been on campus at Syracuse University a few years now. I don't know if you've met him before, but he's a superstar. Got a big award last night. Dr. Adam Banks. How's it going, Adam? Everything is good, Rick. I mean, I'll just call him one, two, sing condolences like everybody is to the Jones family in that time of loss. But also, just to give some, some praise and a shout to the Alliance Network and just to say I'm really grateful that, you know, I was able to be one of the people they recognized last night. It was a beautiful function, and the Alliance Network was an important work around town, so I wanted to make sure I showed my gratitude for that. Yeah, I gave you a big shout-out early and called you the biggest Stevie Wonder fan in the land, too. You know? uh, Stevie and Donnie. Yeah, when I talked about your great award. Well, Dr. Adam Banks, stand by, Adam. Let's go back to Washington, D.C. Hey, Leo, we got right. Karen. Karen, you want to talk to Lee? Hey, yeah, let me think. let me find out some more. In fact, I left law, so let's see. Adam Banks done disappeared on me. Stand I'm by. Right. Lee hey, stand by, Lee. I got to get rid of Adam. I want him to stay on the line. But uh, he disappeared on me, you know. Hey, Lee, you there? Dr. Rick Wright, Lee Kidd here. Hey, knock yourself out, Lee. Knock yourself out from Washington, D.C. Adam, uh, Dr. Adam Banks hung up on me, and I had to make a quick... Hey, Bernard, my engineer, you got it straight? Yes, yeah, ready. Okay, Lee, let's talk from D.C., man. Do it. Well, we're here. Like I said, we're getting ready for uh, CBT in September 2008, September 25th through the 28th. So, Dr. Rick Wright, be prepared to see the network, to see all of your old alumni, your students, and your friend. Oh, I'm ready, man. And you really made my day today bringing on the granddaughter of Dr. Montague Cobb, one of the greatest African-American medical doctors in the history of America, one of the big creators and warlocks of the NAACP, faculty member at uh, the great Howard University for a number of years, and also a dear friend of the United States Navy. In fact, 
Dr. Montague Cobb did a lot to eliminate racism in the United States Navy and, of course, his connections with President Eisenhower. So Miss Karen Wilkinson you have there is royalty in the African-American community, Lee. I didn't know she... Oh, my goodness. I am standing next to royalty. Yes, you are, man. She is an absolute princess, man. They're in D.C. from an incredible family in Washington, D.C. Miss Karen Wilkinson. Hey, who else is there? Larry Martin is there. Larry's there. Larry's here. Ben's here. Ben We're Green. See if we can get them on the line with you, okay? Yeah, bring them up, man. We'll have them call back later. Okay, have them to call back later from Washington, D.C., all right? All right. Dr. Uh, Rick Wright, this is Lee Kitt for the Network. All right, from D.C., Washington. Big shout out to the Syracuse University Network. Oh, love you, baby. The network reminds you that you too may call in to Dr. Rick Wright on Sundays between 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check in with the doc at area code 315-428-1069. Don't forget the doc. 